Nobody expects it. Swashbuckling Sunderland on their return to the championship last season to dance their way into the playoffs. The same energy still remains, but this time around there's a new steal, a resolve that Blackburn discovered last week as they were beaten 3-1 by the Black Cats, who are again chasing playoff dreams. Cardiff, meanwhile, started the campaign pretty sluggishly, but their season has gathered some momentum recently. The Derby victory against Swansea lifted spirits, and that was quickly followed up by the impressive win against Coventry. And just like that, they've switched from relegation candidates to playoff contenders. Pritchard has found Clark. And Pritchard probing. And Sunderland finding some room on the opposite side where Barr is waiting. Barr looking for the give and go. Joe Bellingham back to Barr. Finds Pritchard, who can't finish off the move. Well, there was a deflection to carry it wide. It would have been a superb goal here from Sunderland. Barr and Joe Bellingham connect. That's a brilliant ball. Perfectly weighted from Bellingham. And then Pritchard can only put the chance wide. The brightest of starts here for Sunderland. Here is Dan Neal. Dan Neal for Sunderland. Fizzes one over the top. Well, he got behind that, all right. But he couldn't find the target, and it sails over the top. Pritchard is dispossessed. Cardiff can break away. Well, they thought they could, but they just haven't been able to get the ball out of their own half. And it's Sunderland breaking again, and into the penalty area, Huggins. Huggins trying to work the chance, can't find a way through, sees the effort, well turned away. While well, Tony Mowbray applauding this entertaining Sunderland team who are pushing and pushing here. Pritchard. back so deep here difficult to find the room inside the penalty area to cause any kind of trouble that's the task here for Sunderland Clark again beats one and two it's Jack Clark well he sees his effort brilliantly stopped four goals in three unable to add another here Forcing his way through, Pritchard now wants it back and gets it. Pritchard sees the effort well saved. Anik down and Cardiff managed to clear away. Well, the Cardiff defence have their goalkeeper to thank for this save. Gets down smartly to deny Pritchard. Superbly worked by Sunderland again. Well, Tony Mowbray's sides have certainly had the be better chances in the game. But still we are goalless here. Huggins again combining with Clark. We've got such a lovely relationship here on the left-hand side. Huggins ball. And he's glanced away. And Clark will start things again here on the left-hand side. Jack Clark. Huggins again. This could be the chance. But he puts it wide, slipped at the vital moment. And the effort on goal skewing wide. G steals possession. This looks promising here for Cardiff. Well, it did, but it wasn't too long before they lost it. Burstow now trying to break, can't. Big challenge by McGuinness. Now Tanner, Tanner delivers. This looks promising here for Cardiff. Obo can't keep the chance down though, fires that one over the top. Perhaps their best chance of the game so far. Nice delivery from Tanner. Obo found the room. 
couldn't find the target. There's Patrick Roberts. And it's on this left-hand side again where Sunderland are looking to provide the threats. And it's Clark who makes his way to the byline. Roberts there, saved by Anik. The danger not completely dealt with. Another chance for Sunderland. Well, turned away rather desperately. He's sliding. Gutas is there. Jack Clark causing the problems again on the left-hand side. Had a brilliant afternoon. Roberts will perhaps be disappointed that he didn't really catch the strike. And then on the follow-up, the effort hammered at Anik. That's a nice touch around the corner by Colwell. Mintel felt that he was fouled there. Cardiff do have it back, Atete. It's still going here, Atete. It's Keon Atete, who at the final moment finds himself dispossessed by the returning Luco 9. Scrapped hard here to make his way through. Lovely feat from Keon Atete. Beat two challenges. And a third as well, but the fourth was a bit too much. Break on here for Sunderland who fire goalwards and run into Anik again now Shish with the chance Anik had it covered route one stuff and the ball out towards Colwell and a mistake for Sunderland is Trey Hume here who has conceded the corner was looking for his goalkeeper. Cardiff corner delivered by Ryan Winsor. In it comes and in it goes. Well, it's crept in. Cardiff silence the stadium of lights with a late goal here. Three minutes to go in the game. And maybe the long travel to Sunderland has all been worth it. The final touch. Comes off of McGuinness. How much he knew about this, I'm not sure, but through the crowd he gets there and it creeps in. Sunderland looking for a swift response as they break forward to the edge of the penalty area. And Cardiff find a new determination. And they're on the break here. Chance to come forward for Tanner. Tanner's ball is good, now Wintour, well Wintour went for the bottom corner and very quickly Anthony Patterson down to make the save, did well the Sunderland goalkeeper, Cardiff had the chance here to wrap up the game, super pass from Tanner, wonderful weight on this, and Wintour did everything right but so too did Patterson. Sunderland, they've got themselves in a spot of bother here, and it's Tanner! Well, it's two good chances now for Cardiff to wrap up the game. This the latest of them. Oli Tanner well positioned, but the best he could do was send that one sailing over the top. Clark away, here for Sunderland. This would be dramatic at the Stadium of Light, but well, it's been a problem here all afternoon. They haven't been able to test Anik enough. And now they've been forced out of play. All eyes on the referee. Cardiff have done it. Here at the Stadium of Light, they managed to snatch all three points right at the end of this game, thanks to the goal from McGuinness. While well, Sunderland have been so creative and entertaining this season, but they found it so difficult to break Cardiff down. Their unbeaten run is gone. Sunderland go down 1-0 to Cardiff.